Zan and what to do, my people. So, back with another music review. Been dropping a few this weekend. Uh, I try to review a lot of things on the channel. Music reviews are good because it's free. I ain't gotta buy nothing. But uh, so dropped a few. This one right here is Zero Rohamed Ali, and this is 17 songs an hour and five minutes. And Zero is a brother that been in the game for forever, ever, ever, and he is looked at. Very highly, he's highly respected in the South. A lot of people look at him as a god and stuff. They they follow Ro. They they really love him in certain areas. So uh, I'm I, I might get a little bit of hate on this video because if I'm not in love with everything, but uh, let me get into this project, man. I think I already said this. 17 songs that I went five minutes. So I'm going to talk about some of the songs I like and dislike. I'm going to try to make this quick as possible, man, because I've been doing a lot of reviews and I just want to try to knock this out. Number one, ain't got to like it. I like this because this is the barge flip. Like people always be on the, the, the barge uh, kick and be uh like to make jokes. And I'm kind of light skinned and be like, oh, yo, the barge has it. The barge has some hits, though, man. The barge has some stuff. Uh, Ain't mad at you. Shit, they come from the barge. This right here, that's a DeBarge flip. DeBarge had, had some hits, man. Uh, jump into number seven. I like that one as well. I'm okay. Everything he been through, we still standing. He okay. I like that melody on there. Number eight, Happy Father's Day. This is classic Zero. He telling the story about uh, he trying to be a good father, but his baby mama tripping and stuff. So it's kind of uh, I hate you, bitch-esque, but it's on that lane. Number 10, we got to do better. I love the message on this one. He talking about the, the hypocrisy in the black neighborhoods and stuff. How people be hating and being hypocritical about about uh people and everything. Uh, be judgmental. But I like that one. Number 11, right here. Venting. He he, he venting. He venting like he does. You, you know, no rope. Number 12, stop reaching. Don't be hating and put the next man down. Go out and, and get yours. Stop roaching. Stop roaching. Uh... Don't 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 judge me. It was uh the text correction or whatever. But stop roaching. So he means stop hating on the next man. Go out and get your own and stuff. But a good joint. Number thirteen. Stop the rain featuring Shaquille O'Neal. And this is a flip of Shaquille O'Neal old song. Can't stop the rain featuring Biggie Smalls. And so I like that he put Shaq on the joint. Like it isn't like a joint that I'm crazy about. But I like the nostalgia about it and stuff. And having Shaq on, on the joint rapping. And he sound pretty good. And just just that element right there. But I, I can't say I'm going to be jamming the hell out of this or anything. But I like that. Number 15, Friends Ain't Friends, is is zero. You 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 know you know what the brother talks about. Friends Ain't Friends is kind of self, self-explanatory. You know zero. Uh, number 16, Mo City, Texas. Mellow, mellow singing track. I think I hear that Usher nice and slow in the background. I think this is an Usher nice and nice and slow uh, interpolation or whatever. So, this is another nice one. In 17, uh, kill that bitch. Uh, I should have let him kill that bitch and that nigga. <laughs> so, uh, like those. The tracks I dislike. They had some other tracks I wasn't like crazy about, but tracks that I just straight up disliked is uh, number three, Get Out My Dick featuring Juicy J. That one is just sound uh, like the beat, the melody, everything I didn't like. Number six, I'm With It featuring Brenda Lynn. And that beat sound just like Fruit Loopish and stuff. It's just a terrible, terrible beat, terrible production. But overall, man, I get it's like, I get it's like a seven, a seven out of ten. Towards the end of the hour, towards like after like number seven or something, it it started getting consistent. They had a lot of joints that I like. I can't say I'm gonna be really bumping this a whole lot. It's not bad music. Like Zero, he has a good melody and cadence. Uh, if you like his voice, uh, if you like his subject matter, me, I love uh, Life of Josie movie. Like I still could bump it, but it's like Zero. Uh, his his subject matter it doesn't change over time. It's kind of been stagnated. Uh, he he. It's, it's, it's so negative. It's so negative. It's just uh, talk about them haters. Man, these haters. I hate these niggas. I hate these bitches. And eventually, I get kind of tired of it. So 
Zero, I, I kind of don't really listen to Zero anymore, but I know everybody love him and stuff, so I wanted to drop a review. Man, y'all don't hate me. I'm giving y'all my reasons why I don't really bump Zero. It's kind of like a mental thing. If I bump Zero all the time, I'm already I'm already a hateful kind of kind of person. Like I, my circle is is this small. I stay to myself. So if I jam Zero, I'm gonna go crazy. So I I can't be jamming Zero like that. But I would give this a seven out of ten. I'm being nice. I'm being nice as well. I, I don't want to be killed by my southern peers. But that's what I give it, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Gonna be the greatest and the most hated, man. I let your boy. Peace out.